Welcome back to the channel. My name is Erica. If this is your first time here, welcome. Please go ahead and hit that subscribe button over here. We talk about all things home decor. Um, I take you guys on shop with me's. I do hauls. Uh, my aesthetic is black, white, gray, all of the neutral tones. So if that is your thing, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. So you guys, today is Sunday, October the 15th, and I um, just got the shower, just got dressed. And I'm super excited, guys, because I have been um, withholding some information that I am now ready to share with you guys. So my daughter um, and her family moved to Texas, guys. They got here on Thursday night. And I am super, super excited. So, so many things have changed around the house, but for the good, for the better. Um, if you guys don't know, I am I am in a four bedroom, three bath home with an office and um, it was just me and my mom. And so um, my daughter and her husband, they wanted a fresh start and they felt like Dallas was the right place. And I'm so glad that they made, the, made that decision. Um, to join us here in Texas. So yeah, guys, they are here now and I could not be happier. Me and Nyla have just been doing all the things. And so you'll definitely be seeing a lot more of my family on this channel. Um, there's so many things that we have planned. Like for instance, next weekend, we're going to go to a fall festival in Canton. So just super excited for that. But right now we're actually about to head out for a celebratory dinner. We are going to Yardbird. So we're running a little bit behind, so still just getting, you know, acclimated to the timing and all that stuff. So we're going to go ahead and get out of here. But of course, I'm going to take you guys along with me. So let's get ready to hit up out of here. All right, you guys. Cheers to a new beginning. Cheers. That is amazing. Hey, Good morning. It is Saturday, October 21st. And so I just left the salon from getting my locks retightened. And um, I'm in Garland. Um, my loctician is at a new location and it's better for me because it is a little bit closer. But um, I decided that, y'all, I am so behind on uh, picking up pieces for Christmas decor. Um, you guys know that Brittany and her family, they moved here. So we've just been getting settled with that, just getting used to our new routine. And, um, you know, work started up this week. So it was a long, busy work week, even though I was off on Monday, but it's, it felt like a five-day work week nonetheless. So I am in the parking lot at the at-home store because I wanted to go in here and see um what type of christmas stems they have and of course i'm going to look around and see if there's anything else that catches my eye i have not gone through my christmas um decor um to see what i already have but i'm just going to go in here take a look around it's about 9 30 and uh it's still fairly early so the store is not busy which is a perfect time for me to get a little bit of content for you guys as well so um, yeah, it is a gorgeous fall day here in Texas. So let's get in here and see what we can find. So you guys, when you first walk in, they have this beautiful display of reindeers, um, all types of different decor. I'm loving the um, gold and white theme. I think that's really pretty. Um, so that's what you see when you first walk in. And then over here, they have some more decor in the gold and white theme. Some pillows, some ornaments. So let me just take a step back so you guys can kind of see what that's looking like. But super pretty. Of course, we have the large assortment of Christmas trees all lined up here. Plenty to choose from, but thank goodness for me, I already have my, um, my Christmas tree from last year that is still absolutely beautiful. So looking forward to pulling that out. And then over here, we have a whole display of mugs and coffee cups. Oh gosh, y'all, they just make me so happy. How cute is this one right here? Gnome, sweet gnome. That is so cute. So let's see, let's see what else we can find. And down here, you kind of have like the, the pink, white, and gold theme, which is super cute. It's different, but it's cute. 
really, really cute. And then further down this way, there's even more. They've even got, they've even got the pink stems. So super cute, super, super cute. Hopefully I can find a few things in here today to add to what I already have. Um, so far, I'm not seeing anything that's catching my eye that I want to purchase, but we'll see. I'm gonna continue to look and, um, and see what they have. Okay, y'all, so I finally made it back home and I got some amazing Christmas florals from um, the at-home store. And I have a pretty significant um, haul for you guys. So I'm gonna show that to y'all here in just a moment. But y'all, this month is my six month micro lock anniversary. And y'all, I went and got my hair retightened this morning and it is just growing so much. Like I'm just so proud of the growth and how well my hair is doing. Um, she did a good job per usual, but y'all, I just think that my hair looks really, really good. Um, and like I said, it's just, it's growing, it's thriving. And so I just wanted to give you guys a close up of my hair before I get into the haul. But let me turn around so you guys can see. But it is just, just thriving. I am absolutely loving the results and um yeah y'all so pretty soon my bangs are going to be too long but i like wearing it in this style because it's just growing out nicely and kind of like a a bob shape if you will so yeah she did a really good job i was in and out and i am super super pleased with the way that my hair is just huh, the length, everything. So I'm enjoying every stage because I think that that's important and I have no regrets. I banned it um, before I wash it. So I put it in a bunch of little different ponytails all over my head um, and I leave enough room um, so that I'm able to get into my scalp and cleanse it really well. But y'all, super low maintenance. Don't do a lot to it in the mornings when I wake up. Just fluff it and go and I could not be happier with this journey. So yeah, six months for me this month, um, super excited for that. But I'm even more excited, you guys, to share with y'all what I picked up from the at-home store. I am just like, I'm getting all the Christmas feels, but once I put this stuff up, then I can get back into enjoying fall. But I did not want too much time to go by to where I didn't make it into the stores and everything was picked through and you know there just was not a good selection. They had some really good stuff. So let me turn the camera around and show you guys what I got. Okay, so the first thing that I want to share with you guys are these beautiful matte black reindeers that I picked up. They are absolutely stunning. Let me show you guys. So that's what it looks like from the front and from the side. I just love these antlers and just the stance that the deer has. So I picked up two of these um, and they were $17.99 $17 a piece, which I thought was a pretty decent sale. I also got my matte black reindeers from the at-home store last year as well. It was part of the Layla Ali, um, I think I'm saying her name right, Layla Ali. Um, the boxer, it was from her collection, but I thought that these were just as beautiful so super happy to add these to my collection. Just gorgeous. I also grabbed two things of these black um, black Christmas ornaments. Got two, two of those. And um, I wanted to go ahead, I'm gonna have pretty much the same color, color theme that I had last year but I wanted to add these black bulbs to um, to my tree. This year, I wanted some more chocolate ones this size because the ones that I currently have are a little bit smaller. And so I really like this size bulb. So I'm gonna go to the Hobby Lobby and see if they might have some and um, pick up some from there. But if not, then I'm just gonna work with what I have. But they were $4.99 for six 
of the shatterproof bulbs, which I thought was a really, really good price. So now on to the Christmas florals. You guys, you guys. All right, so first let's start with, I'm gonna scoot you guys back just a little bit. So first let's start with these beauties, these gold holly berries. I got a total of four stems. So that's what one looks like by itself. They were $4.99 per stem, which I thought was a reasonable price, but I just love that they are super, super long. So that way you can work with them and play with them depending on how tall your vase is. So like I said, I grabbed four of those. Let's see. I also grabbed these beautiful white stems as well. Again, they're the really long ones, so you can um, bend them if you need to shorten them. They bend very, very easily. I got a total of three of these, and that's what it looks like by itself. And these were, let's see if I can find the price tag. Yep, it's further up here. These were $4.99 a stem. And so just look how gorgeous those are, you guys. I'm telling you what, I was not disappointed with the at-home store and the selection that they had this year. I think that these are absolutely gorgeous. So got those. I also picked up these gold stems as well. I only grabbed two of these and they were $3.99 a piece. So I thought that these were beautiful. I just wanted to have little uh, touches of gold throughout my um, Christmas holiday um, arrangements this year. But I thought that those were really pretty. I also picked up these babies right here. You guys, look at how gorgeous these are. So I got a total of three stems. They are $9.99 a piece. And let me show you guys. So what I love about these is that they actually open. So you can spread them out and pretty much, you know, form it how you want it. So let me just open this up for you guys so you can see what it really looks like. But I, I think that these are absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. And I had to have them this year. My whole theme is going to be sort of like a white wonderland, if you will. And so look at that, you guys. Look at how beautiful that is. I think they're absolutely stunning. So like I said, you can just play with it and just kind of shape it how you want it which I think is perfect for the look that I'm going for. And then in the middle, it has those little, little white balls. But you can also see how long these are as well. So I feel like putting these um, in my black vase on my uh, dining room table is just going to make such a statement. And then to have a total of three of them, but I'll play with them and get them situated just the way that I like them. But now you can just, since I'm going to store them for right now, you just basically close the leaves back up. That way they're not all spread out. And there you go. So yeah, I got three of them. And like I said, they were $9.99 per stem. But these are absolutely gorgeous. They are giving me luxury um, white Christmas wonderland feels. That's that's what these these are giving me. So grab those and let's see what else did I get I also got these white holly berries yeah, they make me so happy um absolutely love 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 uh, these so I got a total of three stems and they were also $9.99 a piece I think that they are absolutely gorgeous and as you can see you know how long they are telling y'all the at-home store they did not come to play this year so I like how full just 
those three by themselves look just gorgeous. All right, and the last thing that I picked up, oh, I think this is my favorite find. I think these are my favorite find. I picked up these gorgeous, gorgeous white pine cone stems is what they are. Um, when I got them in my basket, I was like, oh, these are pine cones and they are sprayed. If you don't know, I absolutely love, love, love pine cones. Um, I actually have some pine cones out right now um, with my fall decor, but you guys, let me give y'all a close up. Look at those. Absolutely stunning. So let's see, how many did I get? I picked up a total of six. I picked up a total of six stems. And so let's see here, show you guys what it looks like all on its own. Just beautiful. They were $4.99 a stem, which is an amazing price, as beautiful as these are. They make such a statement to me. And again, I just like how pliable the branches are. You can bend them, they're very flexible. But yes, these are absolutely beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. They are just giving me all the feels. And I'm so excited to decorate with um, everything that I picked up this year. So, like I said, I may, I may, I don't know, y'all. I may go to Hobby Lobby. My time these days is just like very limited. And I had time this morning to go um, to the at-home store after my hair appointment. But um, we'll see. If time allots for it, I will. If not, I am super happy with what I have and I can make it work you know, right along with the other um, decor pieces that I have from last year. So that is everything. I'm going to go ahead and get all this stuff put up and I will chat with you guys here in just a bit. All right, you guys. So we are relaxing and Brittany and the family just got back from Katie Trail. And before I close out the vlog, I just wanted to ask Brittany, so they've only been in Texas now for what, Brittany? A week and a half, two weeks? Yeah, about two weeks now. About two weeks. So how are you feeling about everything? Um, I like Texas. Um, the people are nice. Mm -hmm. uh, the city has a lot of different things for us to do. Yeah. Um, specifically with the Katy Trail, one of my favorite things to do in Atlanta was to go down to the Atlanta Belt Line mm -hmm. and to just walk, you know, have a couple of drinks, get some good food, and just, you know, catch the vibe down there yeah um, so i was looking for something similar here the Katy trail is nice and it's very um green and full of nature uh okay. it doesn't have as many restaurants it's not as lively as the belt line okay. but dallas is also bigger they have more trails than just the one that we have in atlanta so it's gonna have a different vibe a different scene but all in all i enjoyed it it was very nice um, it was attached to a nice park. We enjoyed walking through the park as well. And then uh, the Katy Trails in the Oakland area, we, we also went down to the Highland Park area near SMU, got us some good food at the original Chop Shop. It's always a go-to. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, we're enjoying it so far. We have okay. also noticed too that the traffic is intense. Yes. It is quite intense yes. here in Dallas um, because Atlanta is very <laughs> compact. Everything is very near each other. Mm -hmm. um, whereas Dallas, everything is just so spread out. Yeah. Um, and we knew all the street routes, you know, different ways to kind of get around traffic in Atlanta. But now y'all got to learn stuff that. all over again. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So that's a learning curve as well. But we're diving into it head first. We're very excited to be here. We're enjoying our time here. We're enjoying the people. So we're still going to take some time and get adapted and adjusted to it. Okay. All right. Well, I um, shared with um, my internet besties that y'all were here now. So they finally, you know, the big secret is finally <laughs> revealed. So everybody knows. But um, so Brittany and them, they were gone. And I am watching a, a movie on Tubi called Picture Me Dead. Um, so yeah, just kind of having a nice laid back easy night and we are going to finish enjoying our evening and, um, yeah, this is the end of the vlog and I will catch you guys next week. Take care.